show your support. Follow me on Twitter. Hello, I am That British Guy and welcome back to One Pound Wonders. I get myself a video game for only one pound and we play it for 30 minutes to see whether it is worth any more time at all. Is it a one pound wonder or a one pound blunder? Today we're looking at Driver 3 on the PlayStation 2, so let's begin. Right, we are all set up and ready. I will get the 30 minutes on the clock now. So let's start Undercover. New game, I guess. So this is going to be the main campaign. I've played Driver 1 and 2. Um, I think I completed the first one. I know I never completed the second one. And I'm hoping there's not that horrible tutorial thing like there was in the first game. It wasn't in the second one, so... And games have kind of got a bit more cinematic, a bit more story based since then. Although that did have a story running through it. Undercover cop doing driving jobs. But it was very much get in a car. Drive from point A to point B. I guess this is going to follow suit. But who knows. We shall have to wait and see. Not too bad for PlayStation 2. I mean, it doesn't look superb for PlayStation 2, but it's certainly seen worse. It's got a film kind of vibe about it, certainly. Kind of hoping that we don't need to know all the ins and outs of the first two games to kind of know what's going on. Is this a gang against the police, or is this gang against gang? We've got no idea who's shooting or what. It's just a close-up of man shooting. I seem to remember a guy with a sawn-off shotgun in the older games. Certainly the second one. going to be, right, you're in the car, drive! Nope, more stuff. Kind of looks like late 90s PC. <laughs> Dead, okay. Yeah, thanks for the subtitle there. I put the subtitles on thinking that would be for speech only. Not. This indicates a flatline. Really? Why only six months later? Uh, six months earlier, rather. Okay. Very dark. No, no. Atari, okay. Don't know if they did the first two games or not. Got no idea, cannot remember. A game by Reflections, one that you might be able to actually start playing soon. Is this me? Is it? Can this be me? Can I do some driving now? We're just going to introduce you to the entire cast. You're eating into my 30 minutes here, guys. Come on. You should have known this when you developed this game. Mickey Rourke. Wow, look at that phone. Is he pop? Blooming hell. Tanner again. I That name rings a bell. I'm not sure if he was a guy in the first one, but he was certainly in the second one. So... What's going on? Is 
Somebody gonna shoot at me from the bushes. Nope. That would be far too interesting. Oh, that's gonna be annoying. I shouldn't have turned subtitles on. Please leave your message after the tone. Sir, you're clear for the range. You said to let you know. Ah, oh, that's handy. Oh, okay. Go to. Oh, we're sort of out of the. Did... Oh, oh ha! Whoa, that's weird. He can run very quickly sideways and backwards. That's really weird. Is that because I then control the camera? Oh, that's weird. Where's my car? Have I just got to run to the police HQ? I don't know, what's... What's that red thing? Is that my car? Might be my car. Or is that just my house? Oh no, there is a car there, idiot. Uh, triangle? No, nope, that's getting my gun out, I don't want my gun. Uh, I need to change that. Uh, no camera. Oh, it's not going to let me, is it? Don't tell me I had to do that in the main menu and I didn't do it. Oh. Fine, I'll just have to deal with it. X? No, that's jump. Square. How do I get in the... Oh, of course, it's L1. That's normal. Right. X to drive, yeah. Oh, my God, that's quick. Barely touched that, and it just pulled away. Oh, oh okay, you can do analog. Wow, these are going to be quick. Oh, ho, oh, oh. ho. I'm glad there's not many cars around, because... Oh. Can't actually change the camera on this, though. Whoa. Oh, wow. It's trying to be Grand Theft Auto, but it's kind of not as... I suppose that makes sense, the wheels locking, jubbering about like that, but... Can't get over how dark it is. <laughs> it's so dark. Wow. Whoa. Okay, nearly there, nearly there, nearly there, nearly there. I think we're all blimey. So rule one, don't drive in the shade because you can't actually see. Sideways walking. So this presumably is going to be a gunplay tutorial. Yeah. Press this to this. Uh, walk through the door then, you idiot. I can't see anything. actually tell who's who. You a bad guy? No idea. I'm just shooting whatever's there. I'm hoping you don't have to go through. Yeah. Oh no, you've got a gun out. Have you? Can't tell. Just 
the... Oh my god, these... Uh. Criminals hit minus three, civilians hit plus five. Is that good? Couldn't actually tell who was who. Because it says, don't hit the thing, hit the thing. But it doesn't tell you which one's which, and then puts you in a really dark room. Then it all began. Should have been routine. A lead came through on South Beach Bacchus, a major play on the repo circuit. We went in. <laughs> Love how he's strolling out. Follow the cops. Go follow the cops. Oh, that's worse. Oh, ah. So they're my two camera options, are they? Far too close to the car, or in the car. Going, boys. I'll now see where this car is. Not quick, but I don't know if that's a good thing. Assuming that top one is your health. I've never seen health indicated in a game before using like the the thingy meter, the, the old flatliner. Oh, I'm guessing that's just how many people are after you in terms of police and the car, maybe the damage to the car, how damaged it is. Wow. this red line is. Is that red line meant to mean anything? Not good. Follow that there car. I can't see where it's gone now. Yeah! break and turn thing is not very forgiving. Do not turn when you're applying the brake, I've learned that much. Oh yeah, my damage thing's gone up a little bit on my car where obviously I crashed ever so slightly. How far away is this place? Is this just needlessly far away in the hope that I might end up crashing? You arrived at the siege location. And you didn't destroy your car. Oh, have I now got to really badly shoot at people? Clearly not. Maybe I do. It's an odd way of structuring the game. Rather than just lead straight into it, Mission successful. Next mission. I don't think I've ever seen subtitles for sound effects before. It's so dark. We gonna burst through the door?
It got messy. Bacchus took a hostage. So there's me waiting on backup, keeping Tanner from going in and dragging Bacchus out on his own when the situation comes to a head. Who is this doing voiceover then? Obviously that's not you. That's somebody talking about you if you're being Tanner. Use the side entrance. I can do side. Look at me doing side. Oh, he's going to jump in the car and I've got to chase him. Presumably. Oh, wow, that was a really naff fence. Oh, well, that was a bad start. Ah, don't get out of the car. Try that again. Right, side entrance again. Side or side or side or. Try that again, shall we? Oh, I can't skip this bit. Right, don't drive into the wall is the rule. I'll get over how weak that wall is. Find the tree. And drive, fool. Is he just going to keep left, right, left, right? In? Oh, stop skidding everywhere! No need for these cars to skid this much. He's just weaving across both lanes. You're just driving further distance, you idiot! know what these red lines mean. Does that mean I'm like in someone's territory or... doesn't really say, it just says red lines. Or is it a race circuit? It could be a race circuit I guess. For certain missions. But where are you going? Left or right? I'm catching him. Have I actually got to like run him off the road or I didn't really say, it just says catch him. Wow. No. Oh, I've just gotta stay with him until he runs out of road. Oh, is the next mission now run after him on foot? This is weirdly disjointed. It obviously only loads a certain amount. It's like, right, you've got this much. Okay. I'm not quite sure how this is linked to anything. And it's got even darker. 
Did we catch him? I mean, I, I presume we caught him. But he just sort of crashed and ran down an alleyway, so... I'm so confused right now. I didn't actually see us arrest him. I can't see what... I can't see anything at all either, hardly. So dark. Bless American roads. Ah, there's little police view cone things there. I presume they're police anyway. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> Is there that car flying? So I presume if I do illegal stuff in their sight, then they come after me? But I'm meant to be undercover and no one knows. Ah, oh, damn it. I've got to go down here. Cross here. Shut that door. Shut that door. And then somewhere. I'm kind of just driving using the mini map, which is dangerous because it's not got any cars on it. Better be the correct way. I'm so using that mini map far too much. Uh, left somewhere? Where's the left? Shut up! And then left again. Oh, I probably could have gone the other way, but meh. Oh wow, I can't see a thing. Find the car inside the hotel. Can't see. Can I have a torch? Climbing clearly does nothing. That changes my gun. Cool. Oh, that's Crouch. Nice of the game to tell me that. I don't really... I can't see anything. Well, this is embarrassing. Go through this door. At least I can see what I'm looking at here. I won't let me out there. No. Seriously, where am I going? Where did I come from? Is it here? Let's keep going up there. in the most natural way possible.
hang on, I've just got to line you up. Takes a while. Oh, that was weird. Anymore. Who wants some? I mean, it's still playing music as though there's somebody here. Health left. Ah, somebody. Okay, must have heard me. If you're shooting at me, would you kindly please stand in a light area? Come this way. Wow, I really can't see there. Any more? Ah, more help. Yes. Have I made it? Is that it? Nope. God, that was so dark. There's just some guys at the bottom of that. How did they not see me? Oh wow, wow. Stop shooting me. Person. He's so blocky, I couldn't tell whether he was a person or part of the scenery. Anymore? 
can't hear that, but that is my alarm going. I forgot to actually put it on loud. But that is the timer done. Okay, so that was our 30 minutes with the game. Um, hmm, it's not a completely woeful game, but I certainly think that the gameplay probably needed a bit of fine tuning. It seems very fast, but I don't necessarily think that's particularly a good thing. It's very difficult to kind of control your character in and around an environment as we kind of saw there um, you can crouch and roll forward a bit but you can't sort of move around in a crouch state the driving you were kind of slaloming in all over the place um, the story I mean that we haven't really experienced too much of it obviously there was that big elongated cutscene at the beginning and then it kind of play I guess you play through the game to work out what that beginning was so I mean in terms of games for that era pretty standard really a few sort of bits of cutscene not too much dialogue not too much is thrown at you straight away it doesn't look too bad the the well at least the cutscenes don't look too bad the in-game graphics are very dark and look very playstation one ish it seems they've put all of their kind of eggs in the cutscene basket rather than in the actual game engine basket for the actual gameplay it's yeah but put it this way it's no from russia with love and that's on the same console so that is my kind of yardstick for the minute so because of that I'm gonna have to say that this is a one pound blunder have you played driver 3 please let me know your experiences of it do you think it's worth maybe a bit more of my time or am I even potentially being a bit too kind to it? Please let me know in the comments below. But until next time, I have been That British Guy, and I will see you very soon. Goodbye.